I'm a Okay. Oh. So those that are joining us for the Shir, we're continuing in Pasha's Pinchas. It's our favorite, if it's a, even though already Matas Masa, but it's our favorite Pasha because we like Pinchas. Yishikoyach Pinchas for joining us. <laughs> in the second Pedic, in the Maimer in Pasha's Pinchas, in the first Pedic we learned last week, which was just a beautiful Nakuda, that you, we were talking about this in simple words. If you have you have a seed and it's in a petri dish, you can change it. You can play around with it. It could be a male. It could be a female. You could fix some features in it, and maybe more than just some features. But once a baby's born, if it's a male, it's a male. If it's a female, it's a female. Um, <laughs> But the Ruba the Ruba agree that once they're born, if they're male, they're male. If they're female, they're female. And whatever they are, they are. The hand is a hand, the leg is a leg. The leg can't turn into a hand, the hand can't turn into a leg. But when the but when the it's all in the petri dish, you could change, you could change things around. So the Alta Rebbe says that the, all the Olamas, all the Olamas until this world, all operate on the level of Mamala Kolam. So whatever's a head is a head, whatever's a leg is a leg. A leg can't be a head, and a head can't be a leg. But in this world, Shain Soivet Kolamim, Choyshech and Oir are the same, so Choyshech could be turned, Choyshech itself could be turned into Oir. And that's Really, the Nakuda of what we learned in the first ois, and now we're holding at the second ois. That's the Koyach of Tshuva. That's the whole Koyach of Tshuva. The whole power of Tshuva is that in the in the Soif of all the Olamas, which is Olamaze, there is the, ha- the strongest power, is that power of turning. Like we said before, the desert itself into a garden to turn darkness, to turn klipa v'zitar achra, to turn choishech into oil, and that can't happen in all the olamas. It can only happen in this world. Kizeh sheyored mata mato, who b'pchinis v'malu kol alam shenimshech midas malchus is barach malchus kol malchus kol elam malchus of kol mashalom. Shemazeh nimshech ishkal shel samadregis ma'elam adolam. In all the olamas, until olamas zag ashmi. There is the Malchus of the Ebesha that's shined in a way of Mimale, Kol Almen, Shakoma, Shiyod, Lamata, Mata, Yod, the Mismat, Chinas Gilu, Oyd, Ain Sayyabarahu, that the lower it comes down, the, 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 the less of a Gilu there is. Shagilu, what, what does it mean, Gilu? What, what does it mean there's more of a revelation? Where do you see the revelation of godliness in every world? Chinas Bittel and the Bittel in the world. Shainer and Sabarahu showed him his gal of Misha Bottle. Chazal say that the Ebesh the Ebesh says Ein Ami Vuhu Yochel Odem B'Mokem Echad Ebesh says that about a Balkaiva and by extension every place where there isn't Bittel to the Ebesh the Ebesh says I can't rest there. So the more in the Olam there's Bittel to the Ebesh the more there's a revelation of the Ebesh there. Well, Matzil L'Shem Agilu Yerav V'Otzma Shehu B'Pchinas Bittel V'Yichud Gam. That in the world of Atzilus there's unbelievable Gilu. So therefore there's unbelievable Bittel. That the gilu is not so strong, so the bittel is not so strong. Where do you see in this world the tachlis of the of the gilu of of the malak lamam in this world? What should it express in bittel? Where do uh, uh, it doesn't have to be in the highest level, but it has to be moidim. Like uh, the Chazal says, Shazam or Chazal Mandalin, Kor of a moidim, Shalegia, Philo Madrigas, Bittel Zay. He didn't get to this Darg of Bittel. Areze Nasa Nochosh, it says that his, uh, his spine turns into a snake. What's the Indian? Because the, the Bittel of, of Shmanesser by uh, moidim starting up in Nigla is not the deepest thing. Toysu says, we spoke about it the other day. Machzikuna Timusa Laresha, Kimotala Moidim, Menafshekora, and Tosis brings it from Yushalmi. That the Yid says to his skull, to his, to his spine, Yashakoyach spine. Sometimes we're in the middle of davening and the mind, our mind wanders off, but it comes Moidim, Ayid bows, Menafshekora. 
So on the surface, it's, it's, it's a low darg of bitl. But that's good enough in this, uh, on this in, uh, because the gila the kus of the malaklam and this oilam is not so strong. So this is good enough for this world. It doesn't have to be a deep, unbelievable feeling of bitl. As long as he bows to the Ebishter, that's good enough. If he doesn't bow even to the Ebishter, Chazal say that it's time to turn into a snake. What's the meaning of a snake? The clip of a set of acher. We wouldn't even stand up at Chis Why? Because if he can't have even this elementary daga, bitl, then he belongs to the union of Klippa, which lots of love he gets the Ruach Atoma Avim and Aritz. There'll be no, that's the demis and the idea of his spine turning into a snake. In a ragla, you're the smothers, Ksiv. However, a yidasta can be bought, but the lapoil, the kedusha is contracted to so much so that the ragla of malchus it goes to the place of mavis, which is a place of klipa. and through a yid doing tshuva. It has an effect on the entire world. Because truth is the level of seven kolamim, which could turn dark into light. That uh, in the lowest place, they could see the, the highest thing. That the darkness itself turns into light. In the light of in the dark life of a yid, that has to be one step at a time. A person in his own avodas Hashem has to be skafia. Daina sha'ahav as dvarim zorim b'kol yom hamish yib b'chinas is skafia. He doesn't start right away with turning the desert into into a garden. Right away turning dark into light. He the first thing is that he's not drawn to the darkness, even though the heart is pulling him to the union of znus. What does it mean, Znus? Zayna nikre mi shaliba ilot achri dvorim zorim, that his heart is on fire for things that are foreign, things that are not really made for yid. Even if they're the things that the body needs, but the yid shouldn't be involved in it in a way of his phylos and excitement. Like Chazal said, that he does it, like the Chazal talk about the pleasure a person has. In Tashmi Shamito, the Kilo Kavishe, that he does it because he's obligated. The Torah says he has to do it. It's a Saina. So, even though that's that's it's pretty high dog in itself, but compared to his Hapche Chashech and the I mean, this is this is uh, this is small. So, he's saying in the mind that a breed has to start of his Kafia, he has to start with number one, which is his Kafia. And after that, if a person lowers the heat of the koch in Elam Haza, there's a little bit of chuka left in the heart that daddy could turn over, that that he will turn over to the Ebesh, that he will dedicate to the Ebesh. If he, all the chayas that I have in my heart, I dedicate to Elam Haza, even if it's things that I need in order to be healthy, in order to eat right, and to exercise, but my whole chayas I put into Elam Hazad, what's left, it has to be that a person takes care of the Nyoni Maguf and decreases a little on the chai. He does it, but he decreases a little on the chayas that he does it. And what's left in his chukka, in his heart, he gives over to the Ebersht. And this is what the Pasuk says, that the woman, her chukka is to the Ebersht. What are we talking about over here? Al pipnimis atoyra. The al pipnimis atoyra. We're talking about the abish and the yid. We're talking about the abish and the yid, and there has to be that the yid has a chukya, has a desire and a gishma. Can his avodas Hashem? The pasuk says lazosi kore isha, ki which is ish hey ki mi ish lukach lazos ish yud. Chazal say. That there is a husband and wife is Aish Hey and Aish Yud and they get along. There's a Kedusha that rests in their house, Kasu Sholem, the opposite. Then the Hey and Yud goes out of the house and all that's left is a negative fire. 
So this is also is true in Avoid Hashem that the Abish is the Ish Yud and the Yiddish the Ish Hey. And the Yiddish have a chukka to come close to the Abish Tir. And as you know, it's Chilos and Besoifon. And Dafke, when a Yid is in this world and a Sham is in this world, he could do chuva. And in the Soif, he can get to the Tchila. In Elam Haba, there is no such thing as chuva. The hand can't turn into a leg and the leg can't turn into a hand. So he can't turn things around. But in this world, he could turn things around. Therefore, one moment the chuva might in this world is greater than all the world to come. He, just a ha'ora, which is not what the Alter Rebbe is saying in the Maimar, but just a ha'ora, in general, in Chassidus, sometimes the, I, I, I think the understanding is that there is the avayda that we're doing with ourselves, but it has a ripple effect all over the world. So there is this kafya v'shapcha that we're doing in ourselves, but that has an effect on the entire block, on the entire city, on the entire state, on the entire country, and it has somewhat an effect on the entire world as well. But the avoid is really in us. The avoid is inside us. Another nekud is, in this maimer, in general, when we're talking about Olam Haba, um, we're talking about Ganeid. You see from the context, we're talking about Ganeid. That the Olam Haza is talking about when a person is alive. And then there is Ganeid. And, uh, and in 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 Gan Eden, there's only revelation of Memalakalam, and therefore things can't be changed. The head is the head, and the leg is a leg. And therefore, a person can't just do chuva easily. They has to go through kafakela and so on in Gehenim to cleanse. It's, it's very difficult to cleanse. But in this world, the person, the cleansing is very easy. Because we're talking about Sarvim Kalam, so Choshech can turn into oil in one moment. The Alter Rebbe, this is Nakuda in the Maimon, but there is the Maimonim of the Mittla Rebbe, which sounds that even the Olam Atchia, or Mashiach will come, Tchiyas is also, is, is, is in a certain sense, I'm a Malukalam. It's, it's Malchus the Ein Tsoif, it's not just a regular Malchus, but still, that uh, when Mashiach will come, and there'll be Tchiyas Hamesim, there will be a gilu to every yid based on his kalim, how much he could understand, how much he could take, and not more. In Tim Tzaloimar, this reads well into the words of the Rambam, that the Rambam says, Nesiyam Rambam, which this week, this past week, we just did the Siyam Rambam. We're starting the 40th cycle of learning Rambam. The Rambam said, and you they will understand the The Rambam adds three words, which he means a positive, that it won't be over our minds, it'll be kefi But this goes well with the Nafuda, the middle that Rebbe says here in the Maimer. That, uh, that today, there's a certain mila in the mo- last few moments before Mashiach comes, that there is Yofesh, that this is Mamash, Dinya of Sev of Kalalmim, and therefore, Choshech itself could be turned into oil. And this is what we say in Yishta, in, in Baruch Shama, Yochid, Chelam HaMelech, Mishum HaFeradat, Mergodol. So the punctuation, how you say it, is a little different than Chassidus. Not Yochit Chayelamim and the Melech Meshubachum of Fire. We say like this Yochit Chayelamim Melech Meshubachum of Fire. The Yad Shmai Agodu. And the Pshat is like this Yochit Ulevado is Borach the Abish that is Yochit Mechayelamim. The Chais of all the Elements is Melech. Shkol Chais Elam. I say in Elam of Chinus Melech. Umash Meshubachum of Fire. Rafil Adi Yad Urak Shmai Agodu. The Chinus Shem Belavad. That the Midas Amalchus is just like. Uh, in the by a human being, I mean, we don't see so many human beings that are that way. But the malchus is the lowest, the 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 lowest the, the, the koyach of the ten koyachs of a person. It's the relationship that he has to the to to the nation, and not the melech himself, his shlemus. The same thing we're saying that the that we're saying like this: the is yochid unique. 
Chais of the oil, 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 is only from Midas Hamal, it's nothing more. And therefore, Meshubu Chamafar Adiyan is only in Shmaya Godel, just like a name of a person is not the etzim of a person. Same thing with the Samalch is not the etzim of the Ebesh. So again, you read it like this Yochit, stop. Chayelam and Mela, stop. Shumafar Adiyan, Shmaya Godel, stop. The Ebesh himself is Yochit, but all the Chais of the is only Mela, and all the Meshubu Chamafar of the Maalochim is all in Shmaya Godel. Therefore, the Ra can turn into Toiv and the Choysha can turn into Oy. That's the Koyach of Tshuva that we have today in this world. That Chassidah says, what does it mean? Shuva is Adashem Alekecha. There is Yud Kevavke, which is higher than Zman. There is Shem Alekim, which is Teva, in Zman. And the Shuvah Yisrael, Shuvah is done ah, until what happens at Yud Kei which is Lamayi Lamazman, which is Meramaz and Seyvet Kalamim, is revealed in Mamalu Kalam. So, Valdova Zanem Arvafta, Sashem Alakecha Bekoi Alechet, Kalil Menei, Kalam Echet Ba'afta. The after we say Echet, we say Ba'afta, Eis Sashem Alakecha. Ba'afta, Eis Sashem Alakecha, there's Doima to saying Shuvah Yisrael, Ada Sashem Alakecha. We have to love the Ebishter, and reveal his name in the world until Yud Kevavke turns into Alekecha, until Seven Kalamim is revealed in Malo Kalamim. The Hainu Pchinas Yochi, the Pchinas Seven Kalamim, the Pchinas Gilu, the Chelam and Melech. That the Yochi of the Eved the Seven Kalamim should be revealed in the Chelam and Melech. The Pchinas Yehuda Tatoa, the Hainu Lekasher, the Yochi, the Yehuda Dilo, the Yehuda Tatoa, the Kenek, the Yehuda Tatoa, and the Yehuda Dilo. What does it mean to connect Yechud to Torah and Yechud Law? So he doesn't explain it here. We spoke about this in the in the beautiful Hezbet there is from the Rebbe Rashab. In the Kuntas Eitzchayim, the story with the Moshe, with the Bas Melech, that uh, smelled the Tzike Kedera. A beautiful Hezbet, how you you bring to synthesize in Avedis Hashem and bring together Yechud Law, Yechud to Torah. But the bottom line is that I'll be a Torah Asoid there is a connection of Yudke, Vovke with Elekecho. Or what Chesidu says, Shuvah Yisrael Adavai Elekecho. That we, that the Tshuva is until, how do you know Ayida Tshuva? Is that Yudke, Vovke turns into Elekecho. The Pshat is, Navoyed Hashem. What does it mean, Navoyed Hashem? There is the Inyan of Yechudi Elo. Mitzad, Sarvim Kalamin, Netokim Velt. Netokim Velt. There is no world. There is no world. There's only Eibishter. Mitzad, Mamalakalam, and there is a world. Babish is Machayit, but there is a world. And that's the difference of Yehudi Law and Yehudi Tatoa. And the job is the Yid is to connect Yehudi Tatoa and Yehudi Law, which, if we should use the Hezbollah of the Rebbe Rashab, is that that even though not, it's, it's, it's hard to expect of every Yid to Mamash live the life that he's Mamash Yehudi Law, but at least we should focus on that. And even if we don't feel it, Fully, but it helps to give a perspective for even though our avoda is lapoil daily and Yehuda Tato, but the fact that we think and we try to connect Yehuda Law, so Yehuda Law shines into the avoda and guides the avoda of Yehuda Tato. Okay, we'll stop at the end of this ois. The summary of this ois is the Koyach Hachuba. So, before I give a summary of the ois, I'd like to tell a story. And the story will be sort of a summary of the ois. L'chaim, l'chaim. So, the story is, they say a story from Reb, from, uh, from Reb Alte Pochever, Reb, uh, Reb, Simcha, uh, Reb Alte Simchovich. Reb Alte Simchovich was a mashpia. In, uh, he, was, uh, he was sent by the Rebbe Shab to be Mashpia in Temchat Mimim in Toyda Samus in Yerushalayim. So they say there was a story that there was a Talmud in Yeshiva. And it, was a, it was having a hard time in Yeshiva. Yeshiva wasn't this sort of his place. And he was a little better, a little worse, but. So the Baltic call, uh, called the boy and it said, uh, I want to talk to you. They're talking, and they were talking about about a plan, a plan of action. How he, Beruchni is how the Bochah will, Talmud will improve. 
Rabalta said, you know, I give you a marshal. There is, there was, there was, it was once a chicken. The farmer loved this chicken. Best eggs came from this chicken. The chicken at Arangikroch in Ablota, it came out so dirty, so dirty. So, so, so the farmer started taking out the sand, started tzibislach, started taking out the sand, but it's full, full of feathers a lot. It's very hard to, to clean up a bird. How do you clean up a bird? So his wife comes out and she says, fool, what are you doing? What are you doing? Throw a rock. Clap with your hands. Make, it's a bird. Make it fly. If it flaps the wings and flies up, all the dust will go off automatically. The dust will fly off automatically. It's a terrific marshal. Sometimes you're trying to take off one piece of dust at a time, another piece of dust at a time. Just flap your wings. We're in a shama. Flap your wings. The dirt will fall off automatically. The sand will fall off automatically. You have to realize you're the eagle. You're the eagle agodle. Flap your wings. Flap your wings and the sand will fall off automatically. So that's the difference between the avoida of Olam Hazeh and Olam Abo. In Olam Abo, you have to take up one piece of sand at a time. That's Olam Haz. Olam, uh, that, that's, I'm sorry, Olam Haba. The cleansing happens one piece of sand at a time. Olam Haza, just flap your wings. Flap your wings, and all the dust falls off in one second. Maybe shall help them that every one of us now, right, this Hashem, should be able to finally flap our wings. Azag, and uh, we should, we should, uh, we should soar up high, like the Chela Kalakam Mal Mamish should, and 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 the old Shmutz automatically will fall off. Kaloho Yehoyim. Chaim Chaim, a good Shabbos, a wonderful Shabbos, the Shabbos, Shabbos Mavorchim. And it's also Shabbos Chazak that Evesh Alhofen, the Takir, should be Chazak. And the ultimate Chazak is since that these are days of Bena Metzorim, that Yehovah or Yom Melu, Sosin Simcha, that these days should turn into Sosin Simcha is only through the coming of Mashiach Tzadkain or Take of Miyad Mamash. Shikoyach, everyone, for joining us. Oh man, it's quiet. It's quiet. Good Shabbos. Good Shabbos. Good Shabbos. Good Shabbos. A lichtik and Shabbos. A lustik and Shabbos. Oh man. Shikoyach, you for joining us. Shnei, Shnei, Yochel and Shikoyach, Yishikoyach, Peretz, and everyone else. Sasson, if you're here, Yishikoyach for joining us. A good Shabbos. A good Shabbos.